XP in the XRP community now coin market XP is at around 32 cents at this point ranging I did hear that a few people do think the bottom is in I still feel like more people are bearish at this moment in time guys right but next before jumping to system not financial advisor no interest to my value only now guys there has been so much happening throughout the world that it's getting pretty crazy right listen to this breaking Albania joins the worldwide uprising against the skyrocketing cost of living under the NWO, right? Great reset. There we go, guys. Not only that, but you see, throughout the past days, it's like when CERN turned on, these things started to take place quicker and quicker and quicker, right? Albanians demand gov resign there we go guys more news i don't know the, the question is or is the media right showing what's happening throughout the world or are they being quiet cryptomaniac is out. major protests are now spreading throughout europe with massive instabilities throughout asia and americas with the fa finale planned to take place in the u.s the great reset is upon us Guys, with everything we have been seeing, right? It seems like the collapse is taking place literally soon, guys. Like, probably this autumn, this fall, right? Where everything quote-unquote falls. I'll be prepared, guys, because look at that. Not only that, the Netherlands. The food supply shortage in supermarkets. The Netherlands is the second largest exporter of agriculture in the world. The farmers' protests and blockade has huge repercussions for the global food supply chain. No farmers, no food. Guys, I mean, we did talk about how there will be food shortages, right? Which is pretty scary to think about. Breaking the Netherlands is going on involuntary lockdown tomorrow as farmers are taking their frustration with government's response to the city, to the cities. And then, it's worse than you think. The Netherlands is planning on forcing farmers to sell their farms to the state to meet cli climate goals, right? The greener agenda. Remember, we talked about this for a while now. How everything's moving to this quote-unquote green economy and whatnot. But that's just a narrative, right? They're trying to spread out. But we know Ripple is a part of that agenda as well, guys. XRP is, right? Compared to Bitcoin and all that. Reportedly Rome, Italy now, guys, I mean, what's happening? From some of the articles, I saw a junkyard caught fire. Lots of critical infrastructure randomly blowing up this year. Massive explosion at a natural gas plant in Oklahoma, guys, what is happening? You cannot make these things up, right? Wow, I mean, the state of the world is pretty crazy right now. Why? Because... There needs to be, like we talked about before, guys, a problem reaction solution. It might, it, what I do think, it's going to actually get worse from now, guys. As we see from Kim.com, I'm watching the inevitable unfold. Not much anyone can do. I'll be more active again in the critical phase. Spend more quality time with family and friends and use your savings for good times now. That money will be worthless soon, right? Look at that. What is inevitable? Global economic collapse. Fiat money will become worthless. Right? That's why we are invested into digital assets, guys. That's why XRP will reign supreme. Because we know the problem, the reaction, and the solution. And I'm pretty sure universal basic income is inbound very soon, guys. Why? With the state of the world we are seeing right now, there needs to be that solution. Right? But Mr. Pool did state that there's a hidden agenda to UBI. Now, not only all that is happening, we do see right here, 4chan has apparently cracked Hunter Biden's iPhone backup password and are leaking everything. Guys, what is happening? Look at this right here. It's real. 26 gigabyte of secrets revealed on the way. There you go, guys. Now guys, just to the fun part of XRP in the XRP community, now this is called White Interesting. So guys, we have been hearing a lot of talks about XRP $50,000 and whatnot, right? What do we see right here? 
So this was all the way at uh, October 26, 2021. Just read a DM. They offered me $35,000 to show a coin to the XRP community via 50 tweets and 10 YouTube videos. I'll pass. Be careful out there, right? David Schwartz replies, smart. Hold out for 50k. I mean, what are the chances of that? Interesting. What do you see right here? From Riddles, $50,000 in 2025. I do believe four digits is inevitable, guys. Pro possibly at 2025, right? But five digits, who knows when that will take place? But maybe one day. Who knows, guys? Now, this is an interesting connection, guys. When David Schwartz says that he wished he had thought bigger in reference to him selling his Ethereum for $1, I think he's sending a message to us. XRP is going to be massive, right? That's so crazy to think about for a second because, listen to this, Dave Schwartz warned us of us dumping, right? The storm. Not only that, guys, he did state that one time, XRP cannot be dirt cheap. So guys, we know the plan, the proof, the proof is in the pudding, guys. We know XRP is going to be at a high price, but who knows what price, right? Now, Mr. Pool did tweet out right there, fancy bear, or bear fancy, right? If you go down here, there's a lot of connections, guys. Now, by the way, related to this, on June 28th, Pool liked a KillNet post. Then on July 7th, the US Congress web was shut down by KillNet during 45 minutes. Probably the attack didn't succeed as expected. So expect an attack coming from Fancy Bear Group. Wow, guys. If this does take place, that's going to be pretty insane, right? It seems, it seems the hacker group is related to U.S. elections. Wow. Isn't that interesting? We have been hearing or seeing Mr. Pool post about Donald Trump and whatnot as well. Very recently, right guys? Fancy Bear is a Russian cyber espionage group. Cyber security firm CrowdStrike has said with a medium level of confidence that it is associated with the Russian military agency. Wow. Wait, well, look at that guys. Right? There you go. And space is out. Fancy Bear wears a tux. Christmas in July? Possibly. I mean, double meanings, remember? Look at that, right? Which connects to this week? Possible XRP moon date? What date is Christmas in July celebrated? I mean, guys, it seems like Christmas is being celebrated every month, right? 25th of July. Possibility guys. I mean Jet should be out by then, right? So hey, maybe a connection. Possibly. What do you see right here? With the connection to Fancy Bear. Fancy Bear 28 and Cyber Attack is 28 as well. Wow. Cyber Attack, huh? I do not wish to instill fear in anyone, but I would certainly be prepared for a blackout cyber attack type event. I'm not saying th that this will happen, but this does seem to be the direction we are headed into, right? Come on, guys. We know the game plan, which possibly correlates with this. Trump says the Wisconsin Supreme Court's ruling means he won in 2020. Connection to Mr. Poole once again, guys. Wow. Guys, something certainly does seem to be up on the horizon, right? Coming soon, grabbing the popcorn, enjoying the show. We know this is a whole show, guys, we are watching at this moment in time, which is pretty crazy to think about. Fojack and Sweetow, Mr. Pool did tweet this as well. If you go down here, as we see, an inventor. There is a picture, water powered, water fuel cell. Interesting. Water fueled devices. Water fueled, guys. Huh. This invention and death. We will. Run out of gas soon. Need to use water. Mr. Pool's making a joke. There has been a lot of theories surrounding a lot of these things taking place. As we see, maybe it correlates to this tweet. Today is the birthday of Nikola Tesla, right? With free energy and whatnot. A riddles this tweet out. Well, BlackRock got banned. All eyes on London. We do see right here something went wrong. I, I'm pretty sure he got suspended and then he and then his account is back on or back up we do see right here four digits guys a thousand dollars 
possibly up on the horizon soon. Now, the fancy protege that comes from Baba Cucks. I'll always remember, play the fool, right? Playing the fool. One of the highest cards in the deck, guys. Or if not the highest. But anyways, that's all for you guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys have a please leave a like, subscribe, and subscribe to the channel. Peace and day. Anyway, guys, see ya.